so I'm going to be making a easy dinner. I'm going to be cooking this turkey breast. I'm going to be roasting it in the oven. I'm going to take some butter. I have about a tablespoon of butter here. And I'm going to rub that on the turkey breast. And then I'm going to take this Cajun seasoning and sprinkle it on the turkey breast. I'm going to take some cayenne pepper and sprinkle it on the turkey breast. And then I'm going to take some regular black pepper, sprinkle it on the turkey breast. I'm going to take some thyme and sprinkle that on the turkey breast. Flip it over. Sprinkle the rest of the thyme on there. Maybe a little more. Whoa. It's definitely too much, but I'll sprinkle some more on there. Some more cayenne. And some more black pepper. And now I'm gonna bake it at 350 for at least one hour and check the internal temperature. See how it has how it is. Um, you want it to be at about 165 degrees so we'll check that once it's done baking. Alright now I'm going to use this box of Zatarain's red beans and rice. I think I'm going to go ahead and double up the butter in this recipe and use mm, it's about three tablespoons of butter so it's a little bit less than doubled. And I'm going to put that on medium. Now I have two heads of broccoli that I'm going to use and I'm going to use one large yellow onion. I'm going to cut the onion in half. Now I'm going to add the onions to the pan. Now I'm going to cut up the broccoli. And I'm going to cut up the broccoli into small pieces because I want it to be well distributed in the rice. And these don't have to be uniform pieces. We're just trying to get them cut up into smaller bite-sized pieces. I'm trying to make this a quick and easy dinner. Something you could just throw together on a weekday before work. And I am going to use this stem too because I like the flavor of broccoli stems. Okay, now I'm going to add the broccoli to the dish. And I'm going to just add a pinch of salt. We don't want too much salt because beans and rice is sure to have some salt in it. So I'm going to use probably about one fourth a teaspoon of salt. And now I'm going to add my beans and rice. Now I'm going to add about four cups of water. Stir that, raise the temperature a little bit and bring it to a boil. 
Okay, now that it's boiling, I'm going to cover it. And I'm just going to use my pizza pan for now. And I'm going to reduce the heat to the low. And let's see, set the timer for 25 minutes. Okay, this rice should be done now. Check it out. Still, still a little watery. Might have added too much water to it. I'm gonna try boiling down the water. While that's boiling, I'm gonna pull my turkey out of the oven. I think it's done now. Got the rice boiling, and let's check the temperature on that turkey. Yes, it should be done. The juices are running clear. I'm just going to let that turkey rest a little bit before I slice into it. So I probably would have just used three cups instead of four cups of water. Okay, now I'm going to turn it to turn it off and just let it simmer until it cools down some. And I'm going to slice into this turkey. So I'm going to slice off a good chunk right here. That looks yummy. That's probably a good serving size of turkey breast. I'm going to try and cut that into smaller slices. Maybe I'll have one more slice of turkey breast. That looks good there. And here's the beans and rice with broccoli. Here's the turkey breast. And here's dinner.